One last thought. I would hope that, uh, uh, again, I think the moon is close by, and whatever we can actually get a, a benefit out of going back there, we should, uh, before you take the next step. Uh, however, the, the most important thing was if Mars, can I, uh, I ask permission more for one minute for, for this question, and that is, you have indicated that Mars had a, uh, was totally different thousands of years ago. Is it possible that there was a civilization on Mars thousands of years ago? So the evidence is that uh, Mars was different billions of years ago, not billions. thousands of years ago. Well, yes. That. And, and um, there would be, there is no evidence that uh, I'm aware of. That would, you that. Rule, would you rule that out? That, see, there's some people, well, anyway. Would I, would, I would say that is extremely unlikely. Okay, well, thank you all. Thank you, Mr. Bose. Thanks for the good job you're doing. God bless you. Thank you, Mr. Rohrbacher. Looking forward to finding out what's up there, that's for sure. Uh, is it possible that there was a civilization on Mars thousands of years ago? So the evidence is that um, Mars was different billions of years ago, not billions. thousands of years ago. Well, yes. That and and um, there would be, there is no evidence that uh, I'm aware of. That would, you that rule, would you rule that out? But, see, there's some people, well, anyway. Would I, would, I would say that is extremely unlikely. We should go boldly where man has not gone before. Fly by the comets, visit asteroids, visit the moon of Mars. There's a monolith there, a very unusual structure on this little potato-shaped object that, that goes around Mars once in seven hours. When people find out about that, they're gonna say, who put that there? Who put that there? Well, uh, the universe put it there. If you choose, God put it there. Dr. Papillardo, my question to you, um, you know, often I talk about Star Trek or Star Wars or Men in Black, but what you're doing reminds me of uh, 2001, A Space Odyssey. And, you know, our, our mission at that point to get to Jupiter. So explain to me, um, in this uh, investigation study of Europa, what are the, I mean, what do you really, what do you see already? And what do you expect to see uh, from this mission? Let, let me preface by saying I'm a big Trekkie, influenced the <laughs> here, and and our Europa science team of, of about 130 people we have as our our mascot, our totem, a giant monolith that we towed around to our meetings. Actually, we have three now. 